Spanish 2, Science and Technology, Vocab 46 through 50. I'm going to say each of these verbs in English and Spanish and clap, and I like you guys to repeat, okay? 46. To create, crear. To create, crear. To believe, creer. To believe, creer. 47. To describe, describir. To describe, describir. 48. To distribute, distribuir. To distribute, distribuir. 49. To last, durar. To last, durar. And finally, 50. To begin, empezar. To begin, empezar. Now notice how similar these two words are. Crear and creer. My students over the years have had lots and lots of trouble with this. Let's start with to believe. Okay, notice believe has two E's and creer has two E's. Okay, now also say creed, everybody. Creed. A creed is a statement of what you believe. You can have a political creed, your political beliefs, a religious creed, a moral creed, a philosophical creed. Also, if you say his words had the ring of credulity or he spoke with credibility, he had believability. Now, don't confuse creer with two E's with crear, which is to create. Notice, create is C-R-E-A and crear is C-R-E-A. So if it's E-A, it's to create, and if it's E-E, it's to believe. Also, I'm going to create a new product. I'm going to create a new company. I'm going to create a new thing. Okay, so be careful of those two. Now remember, the green letters mean they're exactly the same in English and Spanish, even the order. So describe, describir, very, very easy. I don't think you'll have trouble with that one. Same thing with to distribute, distribuir. Okay, um, straightforward. But let's look at these last two. To last is durar. Everybody say durable durable. If something is durable at last, like, boy, these blue jeans are really durable, or this pickup truck is really durable. It ma means it lasts a long time. So if something is durable at last. So durar is to last. Okay. Now, last list, we talked about uh, comenzar was to begin. We talked about a commencement ceremony. Come on, let's begin. We talked about to commence. And now we're saying empezar is to begin. Okay, well, empezar can mean to begin or to start, as can comenzar. So which one do I use? Either one. Just like in English, you say let's start, let's begin, let's get going, let's, let's undertake this. It, it's all good. Now, how to remember that empezar is to begin? Well, see the word pez? In Spanish, pez means fish. I think it's time to start fishing. I think it's time we begin fishing. <laughs> or I know a guy that got a pez dispenser um, at like a garage sale or something and sold it for like 140 bucks on eBay. And once I realized that you could sell pez dispensers for like hundreds of dollars, I began collecting pez, or I started collecting pez. You guys know pez, those little um, uh, pe uh, peppermint candy dispensers with the cool um, like animated heads on top. They like pop candy out. All right, so to begin is either empezar or comenzar. All right, let me cover up the Spanish here and give you guys a chance for a self-quiz or a post-quiz. Look at these in English and say the Spanish equivalents out loud, or look at these in English and write the Spanish equivalents down on a piece of paper. Make sure you know these five words. This has been Spanish 2, Science and Technology, Vocab 46 through 50.